of the FLRC. Today we were conducting training on various environments on how uh, the cadets should conduct themselves whenever they're out in field environments. That's possible because we can get shot or if we hit the alarm then we're going to get bombed. cannot say anything, they're just going to be safety. Okay? Like that, okay? My favorite obstacle today was the med evac obstacle because I was squad leader and <laughs> I, I pretty much died during the obstacle but it, it taught me a lot of lessons. We realized that listening to other people feels a little bit better than just talking all over ourselves. So communication is a lot better when you listen to, to your peers. So, so that's keeping your ears and your eye, you know your ears open, like y'all said earlier, right? Yeah. All right, so let's get our water, let's get our gear, let's go on. Come on, we got one more. I thought that I personally did good, and I think that my squad did really good. We used it as a learning experience. I don't think that any of it came super naturally to my squad as a whole and so we got the opportunity to learn and we had to put in a lot of effort in areas um, that we weren't expecting uh, and so I think it went really well and I enjoyed it a lot. I really liked being uh, in the squad section because we've been with our company in platoon uh, for the past week since we've been here and so we haven't really gotten to build a lot of personal relationships and so I feel like this we're going to be with these people for the next 30 days and so this gave us the opportunity to really get close with our squads and get to know each other and build up those relationships really really quickly because we had to do really weird things with them um, so yeah I guess we conduct an AAR um, what we would do is we would sit them down uh, we would go over what happened um, some positive things some negative oh, yeah. things that happened and how they could improve upon themselves